Hi guys, welcome to your general reading for Gemini. This is going to be for your August 2024. You can apply this to any of your placements. So we're going to take a look and see what you guys need to know for um, August. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on. Apply this to your own unique situations, okay? Um, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at growth replacements. Uh, keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective uh, Gemini people. Not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. Uh, if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post, when I go live. Also, if you guys are interested in following me on TikTok, Instagram, my other YouTube channel that's dedicated solely to my travels, the links for those are in the description box below. Support me on there too. So tell me about um, Gemini. What does Gemini need to know for August 2024? What does Gemini need to know for August 2024 for Gemini here? For Gemini. So we have transformation. 33 might be a significant number for you guys. Some of you guys could be 33 years old. Okay. We have let go. Wow. Powerful transformations are happening here. You know, I feel like you guys are in this energy of letting go, letting go of the darkness, letting go of dark energies, dark entities in and around you. You know, anything that's no longer serving a purpose in your life here, you're just letting it go. All right. Let's see what else we have. And celestial teacher. Some guys are, are definitely connecting to a higher state of consciousness here. And I feel like in this, when you're connecting with this higher state of consciousness, I do feel like you're definitely working with this energy here to let go of anything that's no longer serving you anymore. Some of you guys could be teaching yourselves at this time here. You guys are definitely having a deep connection here with the universe here at this time. And I feel like this is leading to a powerful transformation here. And I do, do feel like this period that you're going through here is very healing for you guys because I do feel like you guys are definitely purifying yourself or that your chakras are opening up at this time here. You guys are just expanding your consciousness and your awareness here at this time. You guys could be also tapping into your gifts of your psychic abilities here and your intuition here. As you're letting as you're letting go here, as you're going through this transformation, I feel like things are really opening up for you guys. Those channels, the connections to this higher state of consciousness to the universe here is opening up to you guys okay so what else do we have here for gemini what else does gemini need to know look out for work on for august 2024 for gemini We have the Magician here, Gemini Virgo here, and the Page of Cups, Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Wow. You guys are definitely master manifesting here. I do feel like you guys are definitely starting something new here, something something that's really exciting to you, something that's really creative for you guys here, okay? This is interesting. It could be content creation here. That's what I got here, okay? You know, some of you guys are definitely also, like I said, expanding your consciousness and expanding your intuition here at this time, okay? Some of you guys... Some of you guys' intuition could have been blocked for a very long time here, and I feel like that's finally opening up to you guys. The Moon, Cancer Pisces, the Page of Cups, Cancer Scorpio Pisces, the Magician Gemini Virgo here with the Seven of Swords, and the Devil card here, and also the Strength card here. Wow. I do feel like you guys are definitely overcoming a period of darkness here, okay? I do feel like with this devil card here, you guys could have dealt with codependency issues. I feel like you guys could have been dealing with drug issues here, you know, addiction issues that you guys are overcoming at this time here. You know, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you guys, you know, 
have gone through a period of your life also of making life very hard for yourself here where you guys you know have a tendency to self-sabotage things are that, that are really good you know for you you know starting something doing something that excites you here and then you stop you, you know what i mean so i do feel like there's something here that's stopping you from doing or was stopping you from doing the things that you want to do here but i feel like you're no longer listening to this double energy here okay or this dark part of yourself here all right so we have the double here and the strength card here i do i feel like what's happening here i feel like you're standing up to this double energy here yeah and i feel i feel like you're facing it head on here without any fear here okay you know some of you guys could be now let's say if there's like a dark entity that has been following here i do feel like you guys are in this process of getting rid of it here okay some of you guys could be doing a lot of energy work on yourselves or that some of you guys could be working with somebody here to do energy work on you here, Gemini. The magician here, the magician, some of you guys could be realizing your gifts, could be realizing your potentials here at this time, okay? We have the magician here in the five of wands. Tell me that the page of cups here, the page of cups here and also the sun card here, wow. You guys are stepping into your happiness at this time. You guys are stepping into your happiness and your stability here. Okay. I do feel like if you guys are in a romantic relationship here, this romantic relationship also could be doing really well. You know, this could also be an indication that in this romantic relationship, your person could be supporting you on this journey here. You know, just basically having your back and just holding a safe space, a safe container here for you as you go through this healing process here, okay? Five of Wands here, you know, one of the things I'm getting here is I feel like you guys definitely deal with self-confident issues here, okay? And I feel like you guys are definitely overcoming it because I feel like you guys are going through this inter internal battle with yourself of, you know, anything that you do, whether you guys could do it or not, or if you have the power or the confidence to do it here. And I feel like you guys are stepping into your power at this time here, okay? The High Priestess, Six of Swords, Seven of Swords, and the Nine of Pentacles here, wow. So what's happening here, I feel like you're finding pure freedom here from this devil energy, basically. You guys are freeing yourself. You guys are in this abundant energy here. There's a sense of forward movement here at this time. Let's say if there has been any sort of stagnant energy here, you're no longer in stagnation here, Gemini, okay? Things are really moving forward for you guys. If you guys have been dealing with like money issues, those money issues, you're in the process of overcoming it. Okay, uh, there's definitely a, a energy of moving forward. Uh, there's a way forward here. And basically, it starts with you letting go here, letting go of any sort of garbage, anything that's holding you back, not serving a, pur a higher purpose in your life here, and that you guys are working over yourself actively here to open up those channels here so that you guys can receive messages from the universe here. Okay, I do feel like you guys are definitely realizing your gifts and your potential here at this time. All right, the devil. Nine of Wands, the Strength card here. Some of you guys have dealt with a lot of trauma, a lot of pain, a lot of hurt here. And I feel like what's happening here is I feel like you guys are definitely going through a major purification here where I feel like any of that energy that you've been holding on to here, any sort of trauma, any sort of hurt here that you've been holding on to, I feel like that's being washed away here, okay? I do feel like you guys are definitely finding that flow again here, where I feel like things were very blocked here for you guys. I do feel like you guys are definitely start, starting a new beginning here, and just you guys are just really tapped into your intuition here, tapped into self-love here, okay? So, and loving yourself here too. So, Gemini, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.